Okay, hello everyone. Dr. Julia Hunter again. Today we're talking about wrinkles, laxity, enlarged pores, anti-inflammatory, winning the war, slowing down the clock, uh, turning back the clock, reversing, preventing, uh, what's the best tool for the job, why do we have to do what we have to do, and so here's the facts, and as I say, deal with them, okay? Now, supplements. I've talked about what you have to do on the surface of the skin, and you've got to do things on the inside, and you've got to do things on the outside. Critical, if you want to slow down the clock, the earlier you start, the more important, the better it is, okay? Because uh, the... Uh, you need to start from birth is what it boils down to. So I'm trying to inform your parents. I'm trying to inform everybody else, okay? The entire family. So what it boils down to is internally. You are what you eat. Food is your medicine. Everyone knows I'm an eat right for your blood type person because it's a very good method uh, to decrease inflammation as much as possible. So number one, you are what you eat, food is your medicine, the more green the better. Uh, number two is you've got to exercise. Uh, look, you've got to move, you've got to uh, drain your lymphatics, you've got to bring in blood supply to your cells because it helps bring in the groceries to your cells and increasing lymphatic flow helps take out the garbage. Uh, but you have got to take supplements. Now, I know people don't like to put things in their mouth. It's a self-discipline issue. Life is a self-discipline issue. None of us like to have it, but, and none of us have enough of it, but here's the facts. Deal with them. The more you take, the more you're going to slow down the clock in my medical experience and in my personal experience, um, that uh, more is better. And there's a reason you do the things that you do. So what I've set up here is the priority list, and I'm going to tell you why. So number one, what are the strongest antioxidants? Because, number one, what does antioxidants do? Antioxidants put out inflammation as much as humanly, scientifically we can. What kills us in life, what ages us, what gives us brown spots, what gives us enlarged pores, which turns on the acne gene, uh, the eczema gene, whatever, is inflammation. So the more we put out the fire, which is what inflammation is, the more we're slowing down the clock, the more we're winning the battle uh, and preventing and reversing is what it boils down to. So number one, the most important thing is vitamin C, okay? Vitamin C, more is better. But how you take it really matters because you can't just take any vitamin C. Number one is ingredients and sourcing are everything. So what I put in my skin products, what I put, what I tell people to put in their bodies, what supplements I use, have all been chosen about the purity, uh, the testing, uh, the quality, the quantity of the ingredients. Everything is about more to a certain extent is better, uh, but you can't go over the uh, the line because more is uh, you gotta you you need to be directed, and that's why I'm doing these things. So vitamin C. Why do I use this physical vitamin C? The reason is because it's 4,000 milligrams per teaspoon, uh, and that's an IV dose, okay? So all these people are out getting the IVs, and the bottom line is supplement science is such nowadays that you can pretty much get uh, what you need by taking it by mouth if you're taking the right thing, because IVs circulate through one time, and then you urinate or poop them out, and so you need to be taking them on a regular basis. You can't get an IV on a regular basis. So there's a reason you take my mouth every day. Vitamin C, 4,000 milligrams per teaspoon. That's the strongest one that you can get by mouth. Tastes good. It's got nothing but good ingredients in there. It forces new collagen production internally and externally. Your organs, your entire body is made out of collagen, so it's not just your skin for laxity, brown spots, etc. Glutathione. Glutathione is the principal detox um, uh, uh, antioxidant, cleans your liver, uh, every cell in your body uses it. This, it, and there's a lot of glutathione on the market, but most of it just hits your stomach and it's neutralized and it's useless. Um, but this is wrapped in a liposome and there's testing that's been done that shows that it gets into your bloodstream. And that's what matters. That's why I choose the things that I use and don't use the things that I don't use. The other thing that's a really good, um, strong antioxidant is melatonin. 
But if you dream, though you dream, those people, a lot of people don't necessarily need melatonin, but melatonin, incredibly, a very strong antioxidant as well. Uh, the other thing is curcumin, turmeric, but curcumin is the more potent form of turmeric. It's the more absorbable, and there's certain ways that it has to be delivered to the body that makes it more absorbable. So I use the physical bio curcumin. Uh, the other thing, gamma E. Uh, vitamin E has to be delivered not in an alpha tocopherol. There's a tiny little bit of alpha tocopherol that you take, but basically it has to be in this particular form, uh, gamma, uh, delta, uh, the tocotrienols, and it helps regenerate vitamin C. So then you get more bang for your buck because your vitamin C gets regenerated and you're, you're uh, getting more vitamin C because it's regenerating. Plus, gamma E is another very strong antioxidant. The other, th other thing is you've got to keep your blood sugar low. Okay? R-lipoic. Why do you use R-lipoic and not alpha-lipoic? Because R-lipoic is the stronger form of it. When you take alpha lipoic, 50% of it is wasted. So R lipoic is the stronger one. I use the one of the people who discovered that uh, biochemically. And so you take half the dose, but you get twice uh, the antioxidant and anti-inflammatory capability. And it really helps for brown spots. It's incredibly anti-inflammatory and it helps lower your blood sugar. So certainly, as we go down the path of life, as we're stressed, our blood sugar gets higher. You want to keep your blood sugar low. Incredibly anti-inflammatory. I threw in trichromium because trichromium is also helps lower your blood sugar. The higher your blood sugar is, makes more wrinkles and laxity. So you really have to pay attention to what you eat, avoiding the sugars, etc. The sugars, etc. And also using things that you take by mouth that help keep your blood sugar lower. It's also, by the way, trichromium helps lower your triglycerides. So if you have genetically a triglyceride problem, very important for you to take that as well. Then what's the big issue in science today is mitochondria. Your mitochondria, the power plant of your cell. This helps force your mitochondria to burn the garbage that builds up. You want your power plant to be working maximally in every cell because what is that doing? Slowing down the clock, anti-aging much more energy, much more youthfulness. Uh, I use the Thorn because they're one of the best pharmaceutical, uh, best um, nutraceutical companies. And so you want your mitochondria to be optimally functioning. There's some other things that you can take. There's more, which I know spins some of your heads. Uh, resveratrol. Resveratrol, incredibly anti-aging. If, if you have any sort of heart disease, Everybody should take resveratrol. You have to take the correct dose. Everything here is the correct dose. And with resveratrol, it has to be 250 milligrams of the all transform. Otherwise, to a large extent, you're not wasting your money, but you're just not getting the maximal dose. You're not maximally physician strength slowing down the clock. Then, uh, a couple of things that are very important, which is... Um, uh, gynostemma. Gynostemma has been around for a thousand years. It used to be only the emperors of Japan and China could get their hands on it. Uh, it for your telomeres, uh, for protecting your DNA, everybody should be taking gynostemma. Uh, take it twice a day, maximally anti-aging. Then I bring in the things uh, which, uh, look what breaks down your bones. We're all full of heavy metals. We'll have a whole other talk about, uh, about uh, that in the future on one of these. But Metaclor. Metaclor is helping bring off the lead and mercury that builds up in our cells, our bones. Because the other thing for anti-aging, anti-laxity, if our bones are dissolving, which is why I put in vitamin D, very important, D with K, K very anti-heart disease, and also K, okay, very important for your bones as well. So if your bones are dissolving, then your skin is falling and you're going to have more wrinkles and laxity despite maximal strength. If your bones are dissolving because they're full of mercury and lead, uh, then, then uh, you need to be getting that off. And then also strontium. Most people don't even know about strontium. Strontium, 
uh, I won't say forget calcium, but strontium is what's incredibly important for remineralizing your bones. And then, uh, then uh, two more things. Number one, organic sulfur. Everybody should be on organic sulfur for um, your skin, your hair, your nails, for detoxifying, uh, for every cell in your body. Every cell in your body. This isn't sulfur, the drug. It's sulfur, the mineral. Every cell in your body is made out of it. Everybody should be taking this. This is one of the things that I think is the most important that I try to get all my patients on. And then last but not least, although it's never, uh, there's, there's more, but everybody, I tell people, and I forgot to talk about this when I was talking about hormones in uh, one of my, uh, in, in the hormone um, uh, video, is HPA axis, hypothalamus pituitary axis. It helps stimulate your hormones to be their personal best. Because for your bones, for the chairman of the board and the CEO of your corporation, and your corporation would be your body. So it's very important HPA axis as well. So there's a reason all these things are on the website. There's a reason that people should be taking these things. It's not that people are just selling vitamins. It's that they're things that you need to take in order to to slow down in today's toxic and stress-filled world um, uh, the onslaught that increases inflammation, increases aging, increases toxicity, that's breaking down our bones, that's aging us much more quickly. So a little overview about why these things are on the website, all the dosages, all that are on the website, but you need to be, here's the facts, deal with it. You need to be taking all these things more is better, but directed by a physician, which again is why I'm doing these things. Thank you very much.